Hey, what's up everybody? This is War Angel the Demon Slayer. I finally recently got myself an, another Bible, uh, New International Version, NIV Bible. So, today is Sunday, so I'm going to be talking about a scripture uh, uh, for Sundays. Uh, today I'm going to be talking about the... Um, Um, I'm going to be talking about the full armor of God scripture, which is actually my favorite scripture. Um, so it says, finally, be strong in the Lord and in his mighty power. Put on the full armor of God so that you can take your stand against the devil's schemes. For our struggle is not against flesh and blood, but against the rulers, against the authorities, against the powers of this dark world and against the spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly realms. Therefore, put on the full armor of God, so that when the day of evil comes, you may be able to stand your ground, and after you are done, everything to stand. Stand firm, then, with the belt of truth buckled around your waist, with the breastplate of righteousness in place, and with your feet fitted with the readiness that comes from the gospel of peace. Um, that's talking about the uh, boots of peace or the sandals of peace. In addition to all this, take up the shield of faith with which you can extinguish all the flaming arrows of the evil one. Flaming arrows are all the attacks and the temptations and everything that the devil throws against us. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, take the helmet of salvation and the sword of the spirit, which is the word of God. So the word of God is the Bible. So the Bible is... Uh, the sword of the spirit. So the Bible is our weapon against the devil. Um, and it says, And pray in the spirit on all occasions with all kinds of prayers and requests. With this in mind, be alert and always keep on praying for the Lord's people. Um, so that's Ephesians 6, 10 through 18. Um, so... Basically, um, the full armor of God, each part uh, plays an important part in the armor. Um, every piece of the armor is important and necessary, um, you know, to carry out our lives as Christians. Um, it's not just one or two pieces or three pieces, you know. Um, it's not just the sword. It's not just the sword and the shield. Um, it's the whole thing. That's why it's called the full armor. It doesn't say here the full armor of God, but it's called. It's known as the full armor of God. So um, that means that we have to um, basically we have to wear the full armor of God every day. Uh, throughout our daily lives and and make sure we use every bit of it um, the shield of faith um, the shield of faith basically uh, represents our faith you know and how how strong our faith is uh, to protect us from the enemy and um, the breastplate of righteousness um, represents um basically our righteousness and how um how uh i think you know basically the breastplate of righteousness represents how well we are following um the ways of of god you know um uh the boots of peace you know the boots of peace basically that's representing that we're walking through, we're walking on the path, um, which is, you know, spiritual warfare. This scripture represents spiritual warfare. Um, so we're walking on the path during all this spiritual warfare. But if, if we have the boots of peace, we can walk through the spiritual warfare um, with peace. Uh, you know, um, so basically, um, it all represents something very important, um, and the full armor of God is, 
I think, one of the most important scriptures in the Bible um, because it has to do with the spiritual warfare. And spiritual warfare is uh, an everyday thing. You know, it's every day. It's like it's a constant thing every day. Um, and that's why it's my favorite scripture because uh, the full armor of God is basically what get, uh, what God gives us uh, in order to be able to uh, fight in the spiritual war. Um, so, yeah, I um, uh, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, comment down below and let me know what you think about this scripture. Uh, what is your favorite part of the scripture? Or just let me know what your favorite Bible scripture is. Uh, you know, just in general, or what your favorite book of the Bible is. Uh, so I'm going to be doing more scriptures and stuff like that uh, for Sundays. And uh, be on the lookout for a new video tomorrow. Okay, um, hope you enjoyed. Have a great day and God bless.